Percussion Instrument, Wikipedia Article Audio A percussion instrument is a musical instrument that is sounded by being struck or scraped by a beater, struck, scraped, or rubbed by hand, or struck against another similar instrument. The percussion family is believed to include the oldest musical instruments, following the human voice. Function Percussion notation Classification By methods of sound production Idiophone Membranophone Chordophone Aerophone By musical function or orchestration Definite pitch of music Indefinite pitch by prevalence in common knowledge Conventional or popular Unconventional By cultural significance or tradition Folk percussion instruments Common drums By capability of melodic production By percussive beater Names for percussionists Notes and References The percussion section of an orchestra most commonly contains instruments such as timpani, snare drum, bass drum, cymbals, triangle and tambourine. However, the section can also contain non-percussive instruments, such as whistles and sirens, or a blown conch shell. Percussive techniques can also be applied to the human body, as in body percussion. On the other hand, keyboard instruments, such as the celesta, are not normally part of the percussion section, but keyboard percussion instruments such as the glockenspiel and xylophone are included. Percussion instruments are most commonly divided into two classes, pitched percussion instruments, which produce notes with an identifiable pitch, and unpitched percussion instruments, which produce notes or sounds without an identifiable pitch. Percussion instruments may play not only rhythm, but also melody and harmony. Percussion is commonly referred to as the backbone or the heartbeat of a musical ensemble, often working in close collaboration with bass instruments, when present. In jazz and other popular music ensembles, the pianist, bassist, drummer, and sometimes the guitarist are referred to as the rhythm section. Most classical pieces written for full orchestra since the time of Haydn and Mozart are orchestrated to place emphasis on the strings, woodwinds, and brass. However, often at least one pair of timpani is included, though they rarely play continuously. Rather, they serve to provide additional accents when needed. In the 18th and 19th centuries, other percussion instruments have been used, again generally sparingly. The use of percussion instruments became more frequent in the 20th century classical music. In almost every style of music, percussion plays a pivotal role. In military marching bands and pipes and drums, it is the beat of the bass drum that keeps the soldiers in step and at a regular speed, and it is the snare that provides that crisp, decisive air to the tune of a regiment. In classic jazz, one almost immediately thinks of the distinctive rhythm of the hi-hats or the ride cymbal when the word swing is spoken. In more recent popular music culture, it is almost impossible to name three or four rock, hip-hop, rap, funk or even soul charts or songs that do not have some sort of percussive beat keeping the tune in time. Because of the diversity of percussive instruments, it is not uncommon to find large musical ensembles composed entirely of percussion. Rhythm, melody, and harmony are all represented in these ensembles. Music for pitched percussion instruments can be notated on a staff with the same treble and bass clefs used by many non-percussive instruments. 
Music for percussive instruments without a definite pitch can be notated with a specialist rhythm or percussion clef, more often a treble clef is substituted for rhythm clef. Percussion instruments are classified by various criteria sometimes depending on their construction, ethnic origin, function within musical theory and orchestration, or their relative prevalence in common knowledge. The word percussion has evolved from Latin terms, percussio, and percussus. As a noun in contemporary English it is described in Wiktionary as the collision of two bodies to produce a sound. The usage of the term is not unique to music but has application in medicine and weaponry, as in percussion cap, but all known and common uses of the word, percussion, appear to share a similar lineage beginning with the original Latin, percussus. In a musical context then, the term percussion instruments may have been coined originally to describe a family of musical instruments including drums, rattles, metal plates, or blocks which musicians would beat or strike to produce sound. Hornbistol sax has no high-level section for percussion. Most percussion instruments are classified as idiophones and membranophones. However the term percussion is instead used at lower levels of the hornbistol sax hierarchy, including to identify instruments struck with either a nonsonorous object or against a nonsonorous object as opposed to concussion which refers to instruments in which two or more complementary sonorous parts are struck against each other and for other purposes. For example, 111.1 concussion idiophones or clappers, played in pairs and beaten against each other, such as zills and clapsticks. 111.2 percussion idiophones, includes many percussion instruments played with the hand or by a percussion mallet, such as the hang, gongs, and the xylophone but not drums and only some cymbals. 21 struck drums, includes most types of drum, such as the timpani, snare drum, and tom-tom. Examples of idiophones Most objects commonly known as drums are membranophones. Membranophones produce sound when the membrane or head is struck with a hand, mallet, stick, beater, or improvised tool. Examples of Membranophones Most instruments known as chordophones are defined as string instruments, but some such as these examples are percussion instruments also. Most instruments known as aerophones are defined as wind instruments such as a saxophone whereby sound is produced by a person or thing blowing air through the object. In a traditional ensemble setting, aerophones are played by a percussionist, generally due to the instrument's unconventional nature. Examples of aerophones played by percussionists When classifying instruments by function it is useful to note if a percussion instrument makes a definite pitch or indefinite pitch. For example, some percussion instruments produce an obvious fundamental pitch and can therefore play melody and serve harmonic functions in music. Other instruments produce sounds with such complex overtones and a wide range of prominent frequencies that no pitch is discernible. Percussion instruments in this group are sometimes referred to as pitched or tuned. Examples of percussion instruments with definite pitch Instruments in this group are sometimes referred to as non-pitched, unpitched, or untuned. Traditionally these instruments are thought of as making a sound that contains such complex frequencies that no discernible pitch can be heard. In fact many traditionally unpitched instruments, such as triangles and even cymbals, have also been produced as tune sets. Examples of percussion instruments with indefinite pitch Keyboard instruments such as the celesta and piano, stringed instruments played with beaters such as the hammered dulcimer, 
unpitched whistles and similar instruments, such as the pea whistle and acme siren. Although it is difficult to define what is common knowledge, there are instruments in use by percussionists and composers in contemporary music which are certainly not considered by most to be musical instruments of any kind. Therefore, it is worthwhile to try to make distinction between instruments based on their acceptance or consideration by a general audience. For example, it is safe to argue that most people would not consider an anvil, a brake drum, or a 55-gallon oil barrel to be musical instruments, yet these objects can be used by composers and percussionists of modern music. One might assign various percussion instruments to one of the following categories. One pre-20th century example of found percussion is the use of cannon in Chiakovsky S1812 Overture. John Cage, Harry Parch, Edgar Varese, and Peter Schickela, all noted composers, created entire pieces of music using unconventional instruments. Beginning in the early 20th century, perhaps with ionization by Edgar Varese which used air raid sirens, composers began to require percussionists to invent or find objects to produce the desired sounds and textures. Another example includes the use of a hammer and saw in Penderecki S. De Natura Sonoris No. 2. By late 20th century, such instruments had become common in modern percussion ensemble music and popular productions, such as the off-Broadway show, Stomp. Rock band Aerosmith used a number of unconventional instruments in their song Sweet Emotion, including shotguns, brooms, and a sugar bag. The metal band Slipknot is most well known for utilizing custom percussion in metal, being that two of the nine members in the band play custom percussion. Most of their songs include either one or both custom percussion players. Along with custom-made deep-sounding drums, their play includes hitting baseball bats and other objects on beer kegs to create a distinctive sound. It is not uncommon to discuss percussion instruments in relation to their cultural origin. This has led to a division between instruments which are considered common or modern, and folk instruments which have a significant history or purpose within a geographic region or cultural group. This category includes instruments which are widely available and popular throughout the world. Different objects are used to strike a percussion instrument in order to produce its sound. The general term for a musician who plays percussion instruments is percussionist but the terms listed below are often used to describe a person's specialties. <laughs>